I am convinced that Gaudí is the kind of genius we need now, and that we will need in the future. I am sure that if we learn from Gaudí's thoughts, our future will change. Japanese sculptor Etsuro Sotu is currently working on a bronze door for the Nativity facade. He visited here in 1978 and never left. I just came to Europe to carve stone. I was looking for stone, and stone introduced me to La Sagrada Familia, and La Sagrada Familia introduced me to Gaudí. Atsuro became obsessed with trying to understand this brilliant man, and with honoring him through his own work. To continue the work of Gaudí is a lot of responsibility. I try not to think about it. I try to do a good job to fulfill my responsibilities, because it is not just a construction. This place is alive, and we are not just building, but creating a great life, greater than our life. Working on the Nativity facade puts a lot of pressure on a Gaudí disciple. It's the only facade of La Sagrada Familia completed by Gaudí himself. And it's rumored that in his quest to follow nature, he may have used some rather unorthodox methods. This was a baby girl. Gaudí had some friends in the hospital, and when some children died, they would let Gaudí know, and he would go with his workers, and with plaster, they would make the mold of the dead newborn child. Even the donkey in this scene is rumored to have been cast from an actual animal. It's said Gaudí even watched people die so he could portray the soul going to God. Gaudí wanted to do it to convey the message of eternity, so it had to be real. 